While I'm doing it, I hope you're happy. This is what you guys wanted. Me to see Onision's naked body for a video. While I'm doing it, I'm not happy about it. <laughs> but a promise is a promise, so here I am. This is something I just edited before the video because it's just going to be me reacting to the stuff. And probably flashing pictures on screen I don't know yet. Uh, thankfully Greg has put one of them on sale. I'd say it'd be for me specifically, but that's just pretentious. In total, this costed me around $17.48. If you want to make me feel better about this huge investment, I would appreciate a like. I usually wouldn't ask for one at the beginning, but I haven't started looking at his things. I just bought them, but I haven't looked at them yet. And I can guarantee you I'm going to need to take a shower after this. Also, I made a Twitter for this, so I can proudly say I made my Twitter account for Onision's fans only. So I... So I can probably say I made my Twitter account for Onos On Onision's fans only, I don't care. I usually edit out mistakes, but I'm just mad that I'm gonna have to look at this man. So go follow if you want to, I'll talk about how much I regret my life choices. And post sad Bart Simpson edits there, I guess, to make myself feel better. Also, almost all of the YouTubers I watched before this just to see what they did had face cams for it. I don't have one, so I'm gonna just show a gameplay in between my reactions. And I'll show what I can to you, obviously I'm not gonna show his nudes or anything. So if this sounds weird in the video, it's because this is going to just be my raw reaction to this stuff. So get ready to hear me cringe for about 20 minutes. So with that out of the way, let's get to the video. God. Well, this is the video. <laughs> uh, I bought both of his accounts. Oh wait, I, I, I just thought of showing you both, but now I got peeks into his new videos. And there's a bunch of naked Onision, so I can't show that. Now, I want to make a low mention of his na his anthem. Not only does he also have a Spotify, he has a uh, his anthem for his fans only is the I'm Banana song. So if you wanted the real experience, if you buy this, which I recommend you don't because I've only just started looking at it and I immediately regret what I'm about to get into. But if you do do it, you could listen to I'm a Banana on repeat. Oh, this is going to be terrible. Why did I agree to this? I'm gonna have to edit this too. I'm gonna have to look through all of this. I'm gonna have to see what pictures I can show you guys. Oh my god. Let's get started on his first one. The first one I bought. The one he put on sale. Onision Prime. Which is something he doesn't update as regularly as his Onision page. Because this is for his butt stuff only. And submissive stuff I guess. This is video is just gonna be a long, long video. I can't upload the whole thing. Maybe I'll make like an audio recording or something of just me looking at all this and having regret. Oh, f oh my god. Apparently he only has 22 posts on this one. Never made a video like this before, so... It seems awkward. It's because it is. Oh, it's just so much stuff that it has to load for me to see Onision. Oh, I regret- I regret complaining about not loading. Oh my god. First thing I see is a five, like picture compilation of him showing his ass which i guess is you know what he promised but in between those he also shows a random one of his hairless chest for some reason i'm gonna have to make a video on that i keep remembering i'm gonna have to make a video on this his second one says his second post says if you really want to see me write a dildo again you gotta get this post to 70 likes for a blowjob video i don't know if that gives him more money or not but i don't know and uh Apparently he wrote a dildo. Oh, ugh. Oh, it's just, ugh, oh, I can't show. It's just him shaking his ass for the camera with his ball showing. Yeah, he got, he reached his like goal. Did get enough replies though. People are actually liking this. I thought people only bought this to make fun of it. People are actually in the comments like complimenting it. I'm going to censor their names of course because that'd be weird if I just showed them. But, oh, all these people are from yesterday too. Oh my god. In this one, you get to see him dressed up in a, uh, in a, uh, witch doctor's outfit. You know, that's pretty kinky. Uh, I just, I can't show you the rest of them because they're all, like, bare pictures of his ass, but I'm only five minutes in when I record this audio. I spent $17 on this. I feel like it's just gonna be the same three points over and over again, but this is just my reaction. Oh my god, I feel sick. He's getting a lot of likes, like, 63 likes? A lot of comments talking about how he's so beautiful. It's like, what? Let's get 70 likes on this. The faster the sooner, the more awesome stuff I post. Hope you love the video and my ass. <laughs> how is this leaky? How is... Who is supporting this man? Oh my god. He even has spandex, too. Look at that. Uh, YouTube, you can't censor this. This isn't nudity. That's... That's vegan pride. Oh, he watches... 
Oh yeah, you know that crappy uh, like remake anime of Death Note? I did watch it, but I heard it was bad. He has a poster of it, of the like live action remake. I'm not even anywhere done, guys. Like this guy gets paid money too. You can send tips. Like for what? You already have to pay like like if this wasn't on sale, I would have to pay like fifteen dollars for this. I'll post the next dildo videos within thirty hours of posting this. Oh, uh, he's just standing there trying to look like an angel. Because what he does is always put he always puts the like whiteness up to try to hide all of his old man wrinkles because of his vegetarian body. He even has the do not engage tattoo, which he made to not engage with all the haters, even though all he does is engage with haters. You guys probably won't see most of these, but I'm actually recording not only the audio, but my uh, screen right now. And obviously I can't show most of this because it's just, oh, oh my God. But it's just like, I'm gonna have to rewatch this to see if I could show any of it. Oh no. Oh no, he's sticking a dildo. He's sticking, oh, oh no, oh no, oh. oh, oh, thank god. He's smacking a dildo, like, against his butt. I don't know why I'm trying to censor myself. There's no way Susan's gonna allow this, Susan Wojowski or whatever her name is. But Susan, if you're watching this, if you censor this, you're, you're homophobic, probably. He's a proud bisexual man. Oh, there's a poll for what people want. And the one that won by a landslide is, I love it when you post penetration videos with dildos. <laughs> uh, but, you know, it isn't the best. I, honestly, I would have gone for artistic photos of the butt, but, you know, whatever people want. <laughs> I can't show this, obviously, but you put, like, a grain filter over his ass for, like, a picture. Unisian said on July 21st, I recently realized I was taking myself too seriously. Time to have fun. And it's just a picture of a of himself looking like this and i can't show the other three because of nudity but the third one just has a grain filter over it you know what i mean i think i'm done with the prime because we're getting into the like really old stuff oh wait I'll one more things oh yeah so he also has a fundraiser or something for like some sex dolls apparently so he's turning into yandere death <laughs> Also, Yandere Dev apparently has a fans only. I couldn't find it anywhere, but I saw a video talking about it. So, I don't know. I'm not making a like goal for that because it probably doesn't exist. Private. Oh. oh. He wears Calvin Klein's. I wear those too. I don't feel comfortable wearing mine anymore. The last one for Onision Prime before I go over to the regular Onision was this one I found of him in anime underwear. The caption is just great. Once we get to the halfway point in the last post fundraiser for the doll, I can order it and start making awesome videos of me writing something I won't say up close as I'm sucking something else I don't want to say from a perspective, which is awesome. He has a fundraiser. Oh, I, I want to give a fun fact about that fundraiser. The doll costs around $1,800. Want to know how much progress he's made? $100. And honestly, I feel like that's too much money that people are giving to him. I guess that's the only thing they can do because you can either give 25, 50, 100, or 250. There's no in between. There's no customization. That's it. He's so pretentious. He thinks people will actually support this. Oh my god. He's wearing that really edgy, like, black hair he used to do when he was, like, younger. You heard that's my dog. Or what she's barking at. <laughs> that's gonna be left in the video. I don't care. Obviously, Onis Onision Prime, worth every penny. What, 10 out of 10, would come back, would have to clean my memory again because I'm honestly kind of scared. This video is going to be a mess, but enough of that. We're going on to the next one, which she updates like every day. And this is the one that cost me 12 bucks, by the way. Also, apparently, unlike his other account, which is just like nudity, this one is like more of a mix of things. It's like some, he has like just regular like posts where he's just like, Oh, I grew my hair out. How exciting. Or like, or like just a video of him in like a suit. Oh no, wait, no, he was, oh no, he's using something to jack off in the suit. Never mind, I was wrong. <laughs> Such a mess. I just spent $17 on this. And I, all, I, all I'm getting is uncomfortable. I hope you're happy. I could have been making a, video I might have wanted to make, like maybe another gameplay video, or like a, uh, like, I don't know, another PewDiePie video or something. No, I have to make this. I have to edit. This is going to be like the longest I'm going to have to edit too, because it's just going to be me having to look for through all of his porn. 
to get to stuff. He also has... Oh, fuck. Oh, I thought I was done with his penis. Here you go, a bunch of new pics to go with the video from yesterday. 100 likes equals more videos. It's honestly incredible seeing, like, YouTuber, like, like goals on, like, a porn site. It's honestly kind of incredible. He's wearing, like, a garbage bag around his package. I would show you it, but I definitely can't, especially since it's bulging. Ugh, I don't want to say that. Why do I have to say Onision's penis is bulging? I'm gonna get my channel deleted. Now it's, it's all gonna be because of you guys. That video got demonetized too from the beginning, so it doesn't even matter. I didn't even get anything from it. All I, not only did I not really get anything from that video, I'm also paying $17 to be uncomfortable for like 40 minutes. Oh, this is a gem too. In this post, he says, I, wow, I haven't seen myself look like this in years. Thanks for you. Thank you for inspiring me for your kindness and amazing generosity. I feel so valued and I'm so lucky to have you guys. Please tell me which part of today's post is your favorite. It's supposed to say thank you for inspiring me with your kindness and amazing generosity, not for. But I think this website has a lot more problems than Onision misspelling stuff. This is going to be on my credit card history for the rest of my life, just so you guys know. This is just, this is just how I'm going to accept it. I'm going to have to, like, accept the fact that if anyone looks through my bank records, they can just find this. This seems unprofessional, it's because it is. It's usually I have a script or something, but it wouldn't really be right to script this. So now I'm just reacting to Onision's naked body. How did the other YouTubers justify this to themselves? I can't. What the worst part is, is... He's getting like massive tips for like all of these. Most of the videos have like 25 to like $50 tips and it's like why? Why would you like first of all pay for this but second of all tip this man? Like to get pictures of like what his upper body or like his underwear because these are the videos you'll get with him I'll show you. And I hope I can show you I don't know other YouTubers showed this stuff when they made the video so I assume I can. I mean, Onision doesn't care, I'll try to strike my channel, but I'll win. But then YouTube might just try to delete the video anyway, so I guess it doesn't really matter. Oh, it's thundering outside to symbolize my dying soul. So if you hear thunder, I don't care on re-recording this. Uh, for this amazing post, he says, The attached video is definitely a good start. Shortly after this post hits 100 likes, I'll post more videos. I read your comments from the last post, and it was so happy to see you- And I was so happy to see you like them. One person said a photo was like it was taken from a live action film, which was awesome. Which is your favorite here? Ah, oh, that's... He doesn't know how to talk. He doesn't know how to write. Given all the crappy books he's written over the years and the many, many videos of people demolishing them. Which I'll never do because I can't read. These photos? These are the photos that look so great? These are the ones that, like, look like a movie? Does this look like a movie to you? Is this the one, if you were to see it, you would be like, Whoa, that's like a movie. It's just, it's like, there's still so many comments thirsting over this man and I don't get it. I make fun of Onision, but he genuinely isn't the worst person I've seen. There are a lot worse people you can pay to see their porn of. But the problem is, is not only is he a deplorable person that doesn't deserve the support no matter what it is, also just like he could get better, like for anywhere. And it's just like people want to obsess over this man. In this post, he talks about how he's going to do masks and cosplays from now on. But then he links to one of his books, one of his new books, I guess. Because apparently, you just you just can't get enough of these Onision books, man. He writes so many of them, but none of them sell. In fact, in one of his videos, I don't know if I'll find it because he deletes all of his videos because people make fun of him. He complains about how people are making more money off of them complaining about his books than he has from the books. Or the videos combined. Because people prefer seeing people make fun of them than actually supporting them. And I don't blame them. Did I even try to get this monetized? I, I'm gonna try. I don't care. Susan Rogiski. I, I keep saying your name, but I just find it funny saying your name. <laughs> of him standing there shirtless, trying to look hot. And he looks creepy. And it's also just really bright because he's trying to bright out all the imperfections he has, which is a lot. And there's a poll too, but I don't know which one to choose. Do I want to say I want to see more sexual videos of you? Do I want to see more artistic videos of him? Do I want to hear more dominating audio files? Am I just happy with anything he does? Or, or do I demand that he writes another chapter in his book? I don't know about you guys, but although I can't read, I appreciate literature. Oh, the book was last place. Shocking. Shocking the people that are here to see him nude don't care about him writing his crappy books. 
He's so pretentious. He's like, I'm really like this one. He's like, I really like this set. I hope you tell me which is your favorite. It means a lot to see your reactions. First of all, he doesn't care what people's reactions are. He already got the money for it. Second of all, are you proud of something like this? Or like this? Is that something to be proud of? This grungy, grimy YouTuber who looks terrible. And like, I don't like making fun of people when they look bad. But like, he deserves it because he's done so much shit. And YouTube refuses to do anything about this man. Like literally nothing at all. He's done so much over so much time. And YouTube refuses to take action at all. Oh, this one's a gem. You remember how I said he failed at getting a doll earlier? Apparently he did it for both of his OnlyFans. Hundreds of you voted for me to use the sex doll for up-close penetration. And as usual, if you want, if you really want it, that is why I really want to deliver. The doll I'd like to get is around 900. So instead of, you know, doing what the fans want, which is what you're supposed to do, you're supposed to, you know, change for the fans. He's telling the fans, you have to pay me to do it, even though they're already paying him to do it. And the best part is he already forgot about the f he forgot to put the fundraiser link to begin with. So when he originally posted this and probably was like when people originally saw it, he forgot the link. So oh, so people could even donate from the beginning. Not that it matters because it's only at like 145 out of the 900. And I can guarantee you he's never gonna get the money, and what money he's getting he's gonna use for other stuff. He's such a veiny pickle, and like he posts stuff like this like every day. Like every day, or maybe like a one day, like one day break every couple days, but it's like it's just constantly this. And it's like, not only does it seem like a sad life to like go from a big YouTuber, like granted a terrible one, but still, to like being forced to huddle away on your website on and OnlyFans just to like stay, keep money coming in, even though I can guarantee you, I, although I can guarantee you he's not making enough to really make a stable income. He's gonna lose all of that, you know, all where he lives, and hopefully his children. Although I doubt his children are gonna be fine when they get released into the public. I wouldn't be surprised that when Onision's children become adults and become YouTubers probably or whatever, they're gonna be as messed up as this guy is. I feel bad for him. I really do. Especially when, like, when your abusive dad stays home all day and does nothing except pictures like these. Oh my god, guys, I have to wa I have to hear myself talk about this again. He, he makes another post talk about how viral he is of the set, but all of it, all it is is him wrapped around in police tape. Stuff I can't show you because I know I can't show this. It's just, I've just been here for like 40 minutes, if you include the stuff before this, which I pre-recorded, of just like, <laughs> I don't know why, but I found this shower pick kind of funny. <laughs> I was gonna split this into two posts, but I thought quality of a quantity, so here it all is in one big load. So, you know, quality like this, like this shower picture, wow, what, that's really good. Or this one, which is just him looking away from the camera. Still thundering because, you know, God doesn't like what I'm doing and I don't like it either. It's just like, I, you know what the worst part is? I've been talking about his regular Onision page for 20 minutes around now and i'm not even out of july yet i'm oh he dressed up as spider-man too oh whoa oh no oh no so if you want to see a dominating spider-man there you go with greg thompson or whatever his name is now because like i said he just keeps changing his name just to avoid paying taxes which i kind of joke but he did get in trouble for not paying his actual taxes if him changing his name all the time was just some big ploy to try to trick the government to not remembering where his taxes are, I wouldn't be surprised, especially given how narcissistic he is. I'll probably think that he's really tricking people. Even though, even if people didn't notice, which they do, he also has a Spotify. I know I'm recording this during a thunderstorm, but I just don't care anymore. I'm gonna have to suffer because of the, I'm gonna have a breakdown. I'm gonna have a breakdown because of this. I'm just seeing constant picture, like self pretentious posts where he's like, I really like this one. It's just a bare picture of his ass and like the meadows. And I can't show you this, but it's just, it's like, I, I feel like I'm dying. I feel like I'm dying. And the worst part is, is I'm going to be dying when I'm editing this too. I'm going to have to upload this to YouTube and pray they don't take down my channel. How am I going to upload this? Maybe I'll upload this to Storyfire. You know what? Wouldn't that be great? The biggest video on Storyfire is me wanting to die by looking at Onision's nudes. 
Like in between like his nude pics, he'll put like pictures of himself in like a suit or like other clothing to be like, ooh, I'm hot in or out. But no one really cares, they're only there for your body. And that's the weird part about it is, is that Onision's devolved to the point where people aren't there anymore for his edgy content. They were for him at the beginning of it. It's just that horny like teenage girls want to seem naked for some reason. And that's terrible because not, it's just so many better people you could give your money to. You could watch people for free, but here you are giving it to this man, this monster. Oh my god, he dressed up as Cloud. Wait, that might not be Cloud. Is this Cloud? I don't I don't play Final Fantasy. And he still has pictures of that suit. Is that Cloud? That might be Naruto, but whatever it is, it's... Oh, I, I just saw a tip. And I thought it said $1,400, but thankfully it was only $14.60. Can't believe I've been here looking at this for you guys. Oh my god, this post had over $215 worth of tips. Wow, that's great. This man made $215 July 27th from nothing more than people looking at. That's about it, really. I might come back to this in a while. Maybe just like an update before like my uh, subscription ends or news because I'm not paying for this again. I just wanted to mention that he has a Spotify where he uploaded all of his crappy music. He made like a song called I'm a Meme when he's just a sad, sad old man that really needs to get off of YouTube. He tried to have a career with like music. This was like before people like Jake Paul came around and really popularized like YouTubers being musicians. But, so he was there from the beginning and it's been terrible since. Part of his songs are trying to be serious, part of them are trying to be funny. But he's not funny and no one takes him seriously because it's terrible. So he just gets neither of them. It's honestly amazing. Alright god, I get it. I'll stop. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like I guess. I don't know. If you enjoy my live commentary, what I usually do is I would script something and then like go around it. And obviously if I had more points to make, I'd make them. But I'd, I'd go off the script basically. But if you guys think I'd do better if I would just not do the script, because it's harder for me to really talk about people I can't just see. Like when I'm going through like Onision's fans only, I'm scrolling through it so I can just look at something and talk about it. But when I'm looking up stuff for PewDiePie, I can't just do that. That being said, I hope you're happy, because I know I'm not going to be making any money off this thing. I, it's almost guaranteed that this is going to get at best monetized. If it doesn't, that'd be great. I'd really love not to get that. That being said, go follow my Twitter, I guess. I plan on streaming soon, I think. Total War, uh, Total War Troy is coming out soon, and I want to stream that when it comes out. So I plan on doing a stream or two beforehand just to make sure everything works. And until then, I'll see you next time. Hey, Prison Mate Luke post-production. Sorry this video is such a mess, I did not know how to edit it together. I didn't want people to miss my reactions to things, so I had to do a little bit of a hybrid thing because I didn't want to just like edit all my reactions out and like do post reactions so here it is if I sounded like I was dying throughout the video it's because I was and here I am recording this last whole bit after editing everything so not only did I just get done with going through his fans only or his only fans I don't care I also just got done looking through it again to watch it over to make sure I edit everything. And now after this I have to watch it over one more time to make sure I iron out all the mistakes. I'm not having a good time. I want to make a little update. I did take a shower after I got done with this video because it was just... I felt so disgusted afterward. Uh, two, I don't know if this is something I should worry about or not. But Onision followed me back on the fans only. So, I... Don't know if he does that for everyone, or if he might know I'm someone that covered him, because I know my video got decently big, which is something I didn't expect, which is why I made that like goal, because I didn't think I'd reach it, but here I am. So if Onision immediately like tries to claim me, I might not I might know how he knows. That being said, Onision, if you just skip to the end, I wouldn't recommend you copy strike it. Like one, you're not gonna make any money off this thing. Because YouTube's going to demonetize it almost immediately. And two, you're not going to win the case. At, the best you could hope for is just like no one caring. But you know, whenever you do anything bad, people are going to pounce on it. So yeah, don't do it. I gave you 15, I gave you $17.48. I feel like the least you could do is just leave me alone. Especially since I didn't show any of your nudity. So all the, all of your teenage girl fan base can really get into it. Oh, I'm tired. I'm so very tired, guys. You don't know.
if I make a video tomorrow or not, it really just depends on if any news on Jake Paul comes out. Just because I'm interested in the fact that his house got raided. That being said, that's it for today's video. Like and subscribe if you enjoy the content. I know I'm streaming the 13th, but I might stream before then. I don't know how. I'll tell you. I guess I'll probably post on Twitter on YouTube. And uh, yeah, that's about it. Still working on that Discord too, but you know, it's just like this came along. And honestly, I'm kind of mad at you guys, so I might hold off on it. <laughs> That being said, uh, thanks for the video. Sorry there's been so much background noise, but it's just like there's a thunderstorm and everything. So I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.